going on guys? I'm Analog and we're back on SomeshowTV.com. Our next guests are with My Bean Jar and they're here to tell us how we actually in today's day and age can win something real from playing a video game. That's right, not just a cheesy cutscene or characters dance around a victory at the end. You actually have something that you can hold in your hand for playing a game so far. So we got Terry Cavanaugh and Maria Silveri from My Bean Jar going to tell us a little bit about what's going on there. concept is we're a new model for in-game advertising, non-intrusive in-game advertising. For example, that you're playing a game, you reach level three of the game, you get a congratulations and you won, say, for example, a Starbucks bean. It goes off the screen, you continue to play the game. At a normal point in the game, when, say, you'd get a screen that says congratulations, you won, right on the bottom of that same screen, as quickly as that would appear and disappear, it'll say, you won a bean from McDonald's. It goes off screen, you continue gameplay. Later, when you're jonesing for a Starbucks or passing Starbucks, you go in, you walk into the Starbucks, you pull out your mobile phone, you go to the My Bean Jar app, you scroll down to the Starbucks bean, you click on it, it says, are you sure you want to redeem? You say yes. You hold it up to the person behind the counter, there's a barcode and a backup alphanumeric code, and they give you the value of that bean. That's really the golden concept in the midst of all this. If you can do that, and you can give real life rewards to people for playing the games they were gonna be playing anyway, then that's just a win-win. All right, guys, so now all those grueling hours of blood, sweat, and tears, and even cursing that we put into these video games is finally going to pay off. My Bean Jar's got this new, great, and innovative idea to keep you playing. So we're going to check back with them a little bit later, see what's going on, see the progress. Since they're just sticking to mobile right now and they're moving into other things, we want to keep updated with them, see what's going on, and find out, you know, when we could actually get something for playing the next new Wii game or the new Sony game. But remember to stay tuned to SomeshowTV.com because we also did an interview with Terry Cavanaugh while we were there about his days at Marvel and all the fun he had writing from books such as Spider-Man and Uncanny X-Men. So just remember, stay tuned to SomeshowTV.com.